Off stage last night at Trump's rally, there was a tense scene hearkening back to the primaries when a Trump supporter grabbed a protester by the shirt and back of his neck as security was still approaching. See, this is a little, we've got to find the other video. The man um, balled his hand into a fist and appears to strike the protester. NBC observed a member of Trump's advance team holding uh, the man back. The man was allowed to remain for the rest of the rally. Asheville police did not immediately return NBC's request for comment on why the man was allowed to remain inside after his actions. We, we actually have a, uh, we actually have a, video that will show in a little bit of, yeah. of punching back and forth here. And a Democratic... Where this one guy uh, yeah. punches two guys and then... I think it's in it's a woman's woman face, face as well, shoves yeah. her. And a Democratic group is now requesting that authorities charge Trump with inciting a riot, hmm. citing these comments he made immediately after the protesters were escorted were out. hit and, and escorted out. Hmm. Let's this question. Is there any place in America more fun to be than a Trump rally, right? So Donald Trump, Mike Barnacle, says that after one of his supporters punches a couple of different people and shoves his, his hand in a woman's face. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I think that that's, you know, a side dish, all of it. You know, the rally, the, you know, the, what happens at the rally, the clip that we just showed. I want to know things about Donald Trump that I think that a lot of people want to know. I want him to really well, actually. I can, I can tell you this, when there's violence at his rallies, he glorifies it. He does. He says, isn't that a lot of fun? Been, he's been doing that for 15 months. Still doing it. Uh, still doing it. And 